Hello filmmakers, and this video is about free seamless transition for Adobe Premiere Pro and whoosh sound effect for free. To download this effect, I put the download link in the description. Okay, let's start. But before that, please do subscribe to my channel. First you need to do is import the preset into Adobe Premiere Pro. First tutorial, zoom in. First, you need to cut 6 frames each, so total 12 frames. And uh, create adjustment layer. Put on the top. So cut. Then find the zoom in in the effects folder. Then drag to your adjustment layer. Then find the base. Then drag it to the second layer. Second tutorial, zoom out transition. It's the same procedure like zoom in transition but you need to put the base preset on the first column. And then this transition, you need to cut 10 frames each. So total 20 frames. And then again, create adjustment layer and then put on the top. Then go to effects tab then drag whatever transitions you need then apply the base preset on each column and that's it next transition luma fade in first you need to do is overlap the second video on the first video for 15 frames but for me I overlap 30 frames to make this effect longer go to the effects tab and find luma fade in and drag and drop to the overlap video you cut just adjust the keyframe in the effects control from beginning to the end Next tutorial, Luma Fade Out. First, you need to overlap the first video to the second video. 
same like we did in the Luma Fade In. So again, it's up to you how many frames you want. But for me, I use also 30 frames to make this effect longer. And I will adjust again the keyframes on the effects control. Next tutorial, it's called Cross Pin Film Roll Lens Distortion Transition. This three effect is the same procedure, so that I will use one transition for this tutorial. First, you need to do is cut 10 frames each clip. So total 20 frames. Right click and nest. Go to the effects tab and search lens distortion in. And drag and drop to the nested sequence. And the last tutorial is called strobe effect. First you need to do is cut 20 frames or more to your clip. and drag and drop the strobe effect thank you for watching i hope you learned something from me and see you guys on my next video and this is the final product with sound effects enjoy